The Tonys may be Sunday, but for New Jersey high schoolers, the big award show already happened. Paper Mill Playhouse's 20th annual Rising Star Awards. Uh, it means the world to have incredible recognition from such a renowned theater like the Paper Mill Playhouse. Attend the tale of Sweeney Todd. Attend the tale of Sweeney Todd. Judges see about 100 high school musicals across the state and nominate just a handful of students and educators for awards in performance, design, direction, tech, and more. The ceremony concludes, just like the Tonys, with the award for best musical, or in this case, outstanding overall production. The students look forward to this all year long. We spend hours and hours of rehearsal time, so this is sort of the prize at the end of, of the whole process. Making it all the more exciting for young theater fans, the Rising Star Awards and subsequent Paper Mill Conservatory scholarships for a select few helped launch the careers of big names like Anne Hathaway, TV and Broadway's Laura Benanti, Tony winner for the Book of Mormon, Nikki James, and Tony nominee for Chaplin, Rob McClure. Many of the award alums came back to present. The rising star for Outstanding Actor in a Supporting Role goes to Sean McManus. <laughs> Nikki M. James just said my name, so, you know, <laughs> bucket list. Part of the experience for students is connecting with kids from different high schools who share similar interests. McClure met his best friend Matt Scott at his first Rising Star Awards. They went on to tie for the Lead Actor Award his senior year. He was the moment I learned just how small a fish I was in the big pond of things. Because it's easy in your hometown to think you're the best, you know, and then you show up to the Rising Star Awards and that's one of the great things it does is that it exposes these kids to a bunch of, not, not competition, but to their community. I'm here surrounded by peasants and soldiers and cats and flappers, but they all have one thing in common. We're theater people. people! The students say their high school musical experiences have taught them how to be team players, to feel empathy through characters and to build a work ethic. But they all say the big takeaway is that they learned that they're part of this broader community. I think the number one thing I learned was um, that there was a place for me. I found my people. The Rising Star Awards may be over, but for scholarship recipients, the journey has just begun. Conservatory classes start at the end of June. In Melbourne, I'm Maddie Orton for NJTV News.